Hello, I'm about to start the uh, No High Bronca mission. I'm literally right at the start here. And as soon as I open this gate, it will start. So, pretty much what you need to do is clear these guys. And it's because of it's because of that car you, you really it, you almost die. So you run to uh, here, but I'm going to try something a bit different because you get another couple of uh, another couple of cars here, and I think it's going to be a bit easier if I. If I do that, so there's another car coming down now. Oh, what the? So if we kill those... And then head on over to... Uh, to Joel's apartment. That's the, the thing. This is why I say it, it's a bit easy. Because... You just get those four cars. Once you've got the, uh, the goods then it, it's literally like just just the case of uh, of delivering to your man and the good thing is then I've still got one life So uh, press L1 to pick up the jelly can. Ah, oh, right. Okay. I don't need the jelly can because uh, I'm not going to use that to destroy any cars because that's the next part of this mission. Is we go down to this part. It. The thing with uh, this mission as well, um, is that you start up there, but what you need to do is by the time you've come down to the end of the alley, You've got the boss who, uh, like, you know, tries to make a, a run for it sort of thing. So, 
what I will do is park that car there. Make my way up. up here. It's a pity really that you couldn't. Gets, well, you could probably climb over, but hmm. Sorry for the lack, the lack of uh, talk. <laughs> I'm uh, concentrating a bit here. Um, thing is you can use uh, Sorry for the, uh, the silence there, um, just take a little bit of concentration. Um, well, it started me all up here, I'm not sure, but... Uh, it kind of does start you off there from from where you, you left off, if you know what I mean. Now I think there's a guy behind there, I'm not sure. So basically what I'm going to do is try and creep. Which I don't think is going to work. Because the main thing is, what brings all the the uh, all the guys out is when you destroy the cars. So basically, what I'm trying to do is.
if I do it quietly. Then... I'm not going to have them all. Or coming out at me, if you know what I mean. So... You see that they're a bit more, a bit more. They're a bit easier to handle because uh, I mean, really, they come to you. Oh shit! No. Where did that go again? Shit, shit, shit. Oh, God, the fucking tires have popped. Oh, I don't believe that. I've got him right there. And my gun decides to be a shit shot. And the fucking train. Oh my god, I don't believe that. Come on, come on. I didn't do it last time. You don't have to take the guy out. You can pass the... Uh... Oh shit, what the? Where did he go? And as you can see, I've got like no front tires. So this is going to be a little tricky. I mean, I'm hoping that uh, he also has no tires or something at least. Which he apparently does.
Come on, really. What the fuck? No, 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 no. Ah, shit. Oh my god! <laughs> Was that so close? Oh, what? Okay, so there we go. Taking him out. Nice big chunk of money. Lots of RP. And that's how you do it. <laughs> it's maybe not the best way of doing it, but... It got there in the end, and so... Uh, there we go. Well, for that, I will thank you for watching this, if you've managed to make it all the way through my bit of a mess. And, uh, as other people say, please give it a like, subscribe for more, and yada bloody yada. And I shall see you next time in my next video. Thank you for watching. <laughs>